Hello there. I'm going to show you a, a bit of extra stuff I've done to my layout over the last what couple of months or so. And um, yeah, there's a extra siding, there's some extra lights. I've put some lights in some of the locos and different things, alterations. Yeah, so I oh, hope you enjoy it. Okay, here's my layout and I've done a few things like these lights you can see flashing straight away they're like um, you know like they're having a party so I put those in yeah and the engine shed which I done a little short video about that as well so that gets you to see that um, yeah so um, yeah what I did I put a tunnel going through the back wall uh, with a lift out arch because obviously the boards part there for where the layout splits but yeah and the reason for that was because on the outer track the two rail there's not really much sidings I don't have many like one there a couple over there one at the back and it adds a few more bits you know for me to store some rolling stock in so I'll show you what I've done I built an extension part on the back that sticks out which removes with um, toggle button buttons um, and it's got feet on it as well so yeah two feet there just to support it properly yeah, I had one of these um, uncoupling spoons, but the top bit broke off because it was only plastic. It's just a trying one. So I actually made another one and ended up using an apostle spoon. So I just hammered the spoon part flat, reshaped it, and it actually does a really good job. So for uncoupling, a little hole at the top. So that just holds on that pin and I have got a point there I've got a couple of points in here that they're very close but this one was behind here so I thought well you know I just rig up like a arm to just do the job um, which helps to you know if you're sitting this side I've still got the three point switches for this end of the layout just at the back there so they're still accessible and um, yeah so I've put some lights in some um, rolling stock too and yeah so these well this comes with a light in it already in the front and back which are, are nice and I put that with some extra weight in it because it needed more weight to pull the rake of coaches around that I've got now mark two coaches um, with lights in these um, yeah so let's get that going round, oh, wrong way, there you go, so we've got lights in the front of that, and we've got lights in the coaches themselves, now oh, it's derailed for some reason, it would do that wouldn't it, so let's just put that back on, looks like it's playing up now, and it was fine, now let's try again, there we go, alright, so we're going round now. Okay, now as you can see the lights in all the coaches are on and I also put the LED lights in the back so it's got one following the train behind. Yeah, so that's that one. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to park this up in this siding as I call it now, it's a passing loop really. Right, I, uh, actually I'm going to put it put it into a different and that's derailed again for some reason. I think the bogue is a bit tight on that, that's what's causing that problem. Okay let's send it round again and we're going to change that point and that one over the back and we're going to Send that around the other side because it's too long to fit in the other one. 
So we're going to put that just about there. We change these two points and we're going to change this side in now for the DMU which I put lights in it. It's got front and back lights and interior lighting so they're directional. Yeah, so I'm going to stop that there and we're going to change this point like that and we'll send it round. Which is a really nice train now. Let's turn the light off a little bit. Yeah, so I'll turn the light back on. Put the fine switch. Okay, so I'm going to drive that back into the siding next. So I've changed that point. And if I can do this without too much of a problem. Disappear through the through the tunnel, and now it's in the bank. So yeah, always something else to do to the layout. Um, plenty of time to find more things to do, but just gets better and better. <laughs> well, that was my video for today, and if you like give me a thumbs up or subscribe if you've not seen my channel before and um, I'll upload some more at another time so take care bye for now